Good day, good day, royal fans. Today's news. Royal patronages are distributed to members of the royal family by the Queen. Prince Harry and Meghan Markle, Duchess of Sussex, left swathes of vacant patronages behind following their bombshell exit from work in royal life. Camilla, Duchess of Cornwall, could be the next to get a new patronage from the Queen in an area close to the Duchess's heart, according to reports. Camilla is thought to be an enthusiast of the dramatic arts, and reportedly she could soon be the next royal patron of the National Theatre. In 2019, the Queen gave the patronage to Meghan, which was fitting given her successful acting career before joining the royal family. A source reportedly close to Camilla told the Sunday Times that the Duchess was disappointed not to get the prestigious patronage back in 2019. In February 2021, following a review period after Harry and Meghan's royal exit in March of 2020, the couple returned their royal patronages to the Queen. Last year, the National Theatre paid tribute to Meghan for her support in making theatre accessible to all during her time as the organisation's patron. As non-working royals, Harry and Meghan kept several of their private patronages following their royal exit. Meghan still holds patronages for Smart Works and the animal charity Mayhew, while Prince Harry has kept many patronages, including Centre Bale, Wild Child and the Invictus Games. If Camilla gets a new royal patronage this year from the Queen, she will join Kate, Duchess of Cambridge, who has just been given two roles that previously belonged to Prince Harry. Kate has taken on roles as patron of the Rugby Football Union and the Rugby Football League. Kate's latest appointments will be included in the Duchess's already extensive sporting portfolio with her interest in tennis and fitness well documented. Thank you guys for watching today's headline. You know the drill. Like, comment and subscribe for the latest royal content. Goodbye for now.